I am. Hello, cave entrance. Just everything's been attacking me on this treacherous path. Over there, smoke signal. Look. All right, guys, how you doing? We are back with survival fountain of youth. This is the 16th century Caribbean survival where we just got shipwrecked. And we grabbed two items. We was only allowed two items out of about ten to get out. There were swords. There was pistol and ammo, which I wish I took. Because you can craft axes, like, with sticks and stones and stuff. But I took a big metal axe, because why not? Uh, and actually, I took the navy coat as well, which actually adds warmth. And a bit of armor. So, we're sort of in the tutorial phase. We did a half an hour episode last time. Where we just sort of wandered around... And learn what to do. So this is the crafting. It's uh, it's there's lots in here. It's pretty complex. Look at this, a canoe and a raft. Didn't even see that last time. Foundations. You know, you can build a house and things like that. So we will be building a top-notch, high-quality survival shelter. But um, yeah, we need some long sticks, some wide leaves because I quite fancy this portable box, which I'm guessing is um, like a backpack. There's a leaf hat, so these all have actual effects. These uh, protect you against the sun. Leaf cape, you know, increases sun protection. These all do. And I've got my flippy floppies, man. My leaf sandals. You can't see my feet, but... So we left it at the fire last time. We're actually going to collect a load of leaves. Uh, that's my leaf bed. Uh, my energy is quite low. I could be doing with a bit of a snooze. I'm not sure if it's night time or just foggy, so... Let's set a minus 60. Look at this. This is for 13 hours. Man, I'm just going to do one. I just, uh, it's only giving me a little bit of energy there. Maybe a bit more energy. Let's do this. Okay, wakey, wakey. Right, we've got a wound that's healing. We managed to craft a bandage. We've got a little bit of energy there. Um, find a rope. Apparently, I just shipwrecked in my tighty whities So this is the axe we took. And we've actually crafted spears and things like that. Um, we've got a fire starter in there. The spindle fire starter. Twisted fire starter. We've got the... Uh, chamomile juice which helps against indigestion stomach problems things like that so you can get part of scraps here we go so here's a saucy little hidden rope for us so we've added rope from the ship find a rope past so now i've got to climb up the cartographer tree it's the leon's rope or craft my own press w to approach the ladder and climb do you reckon that's a cartographer tree that's a pretty big that's the biggest tree in the area Aha! All right, so we didn't wrap the rope around it as much. We just, out of that tiny rope we picked up, we made a 50-foot ladder. So, uh... Oh, wow. The little monster down there waiting to eat me as well. Oh. Okay. Bruh. Right, we're at the top. Hey, look at this. A bird's nest. Feather. Eggs. Worms. Let's hope it's not a pterodactyl. Uh, mapping range is 226. It takes three hours we're going to be up here for. The weather is too bad. I should wait for it to get better. T to skip time. Alright, so big improvement on the weather apparently. Let's do the mapping process. Three hours. <laughs> um, let me just quick check my inventory because... Are these... I, oh, man... The crabs that I got. Nah, <laughs> the food crabs that I got. Um, story will complete. Oh my god! We need some food and water now. But we've done the tutorial, so you need to follow the story and explore the world on your own. Let's go. New goal. Find the survivors. There's actual survivors. Oh. How unsettling is this view? Uh, it says find the survivors. Let's have a look at the map now. Wow. All right. Come on. Oh. Got here. Dog respawn. Right, journal. Find the survivors. Linked document. Grotto location map. Grotto. Okay. Cave. A beach and a cave. The so big mountain. Right. So this is the island of hope. This is where we are. Uh, so it's not such a big island. Look at that. That. Okay. That has got to be it. Here. What else have we got? The world map. So there's actually one, two, three, four locations around me. Locations one of three visited. Often sunny, occasional rain, stone, clay, and obsidian, different resources. Holy my god. Alright. 
Well, I'm going to go with theory one, which proved to maybe be right. Aha! Hello, cave entrance. How do you? Right. Uh, excuse me, is this a... Bones? Oh, hello. Ancient hunting drawing. Well, that looks like a deer to me. This thing. What is that? The whale? T-Rex? Look at these trail of ripe coconuts. We are just going to craft us some food and drink here for a second. Because, yes. We need to sort ourselves out. I wonder if this will give me the runs. Fried eggs. Campfire with stones. Obviously, the stones heat up and you just crack the eggs straight onto the stones. That is sick. Range weapon. Right, we've got stone arrows we can make now. Uh, we're leveling up nicely. Yeah, inventory. <laughs> All right, we have found the cave. <gasps> Poisonous. Mm, scorpions. Crafting resource. Scorpions can be found in caves and the jungle. What's the crafting with these? Um... Processed scorpion venom. Simply protects from disease progression. Okay. Well, if I'm on to then, let's just make sure we don't get stabbed by one. Find a scrap. There's a campfire with stones. Oh God, this ain't working, is it? Right. Excuse me, mate. My strength leveled up. Yeah, boys. Uh, another stick, please. Ignite. Oh my God, we got it going. Okay, what I'm going to do... Is actually make these fried eggs quick, man. Whoa, my cooking's leveled up. <laughs> All right. Upgrade with a pot. Okay, I ain't got a pot. Uh, we got enough for the bandage. And we're missing the wild leaves there. But I'll tell you what. Look at the food on these eggs, boys. Let's have one. It's boiling 13.8 days. Right, we got a thing on here that will... Oh, we've got some living water. I'm leaving this bottle of living water so that the person who finds it can restore their health if their ship wrecks. Good luck to you, friend. Oh, what's this? Our captain, Juan Ponce de Leon, also survived the shipwreck. Nice. Sea currents brought him to this same island just a bit earlier before my awakening. He located the grotto and made it his temporary shelter. Then he started to act quickly and decisively. After building up the temporary camp, the captain began to explore the island. He named it the Island of Hope. All right, following the captain. During another trip, he heard distant cannon shots. It was a signal from one of our ships. Nice. The captain left this note, then hurriedly packed up and sailed toward the sound of the cannon fire. He was okay. in a rush to help his crew. Running quickly, he forgot his spyglass on the other side of the island. If I find it, I will be able to look around the island. All right, so, wow. Head of the expedition studying the islands, spent a few days investigating the island. Found ruins and other traces of ancient civilization. We spawned the bay to the east, heard a distant cannon fire, blah blah blah. Everything we just heard, basically. That is sick. Unfinished region of the map. That says Santiago. That was the ship we was on. There's plenty of stuff here. Oh, we can get bone there. Check the map on the wall. Kadoosh. New goal, Forgotten Spyglass. The location of two water sources on the map. The coastal grotto and the place where he lost his spyglass. Okie dokie. So reach the location near... Uh, where is it? Reach the location near the bay. He okay, drew a map. Spyglass was left. Right, we're off to get a spyglass, boys and girls. So we're leaving the fire. It's dark. What's 20% chance of injury from like stumbling and stuff? That's pretty insane. Okay, so the bay. Okay. Let's build a bed. 
Plenty of leaves in here for a reason. Right, bed's done. Bat snooze till morning, eight hours. Stats are all banging now. Let's go. Okay, location for the spyglass. Look at this, this is absolutely gorgeous, man. Okay, so it just basically says follow the beach all the way around. A little bit inland will be a spot for water. Add a spyglass remained in the place where vi uh, fireflies are visible at night. Alright, it looks like a man-made structure up ahead. I don't know if they're sort of towers. Maybe it's part of the ancient civilization he was talking about. We can't go in just yet because of the mountains, so... Alright, pretty interesting. What is that flashing over there? It's massive. Hint, hint this way. Oh, wow, okay. Look at this. Maybe got some Aztec ruins, got some stairs there. Like a massive mural on the wall. Let's investigate this. Look at this. Ancient drawing. A perk has been obtained. 23. Song of the Punishment and the Gifted. Okay. Uh, we can actually add a perk point. In this mode, special objects, weapons, ammo and drop bags are highlighted. Okay. Okay, that might be pretty useful. Look at that. It's actually located some stuff. Hell yeah. Well, not for long. What is this, man? A piece of a native map. Let's go. And then we've got some skulls up here. That's never a good sign. Alright, maps. Right, so Spanish way, get a clue from surviving crew members. Natives way, piece of native maps. Technological way, learn the blueprint for a better ship. You need to be at the helm of the ship. Okay, we haven't got a ship yet. I'm guessing we're learning the basics and the start of the story on this island. And then we'll get a ship, man. So you can't get in anywhere. It's legit. It's just a wall mural. Okay, it's getting interesting though, man. Uh, looks like this goes inland a bit. I don't really want to stray off course of the coast. Might be. What in the hell, man? Damn! How you like me now, boy? <laughs> right, it was a harpy. I'm just going to take the feathers for arrows for when I learned the bow. I need two narrow, two wide, and two long sticks. I still don't know how to get... What's that angry little thing? They call them dogs on here. I don't need them. Right, you stop growling me, nasty pasty, mate. I'm just going to go inland a little bit and have a look. As if a bird attacked me, man. That's sick. Right. Uh, okay, look. Like a fell over man-made wall, doesn't it? That actual bricks. It's not a natural rock. Ah, damage from the plant. That's a thought. That's a thorn bush, man. No way. Still says an animal is hunting me. So I can't actually break through it at the minute. But I can just run through and deal some pain. I'm guessing it's the bird, the harpy. There's a couple of ways to go here. Right, heading down here. There's a growly boy. A plant I've never seen. You have to be careful. Dragon fruit. Okay, the tire. Okay. Eat them up, more chamomile down there. Oh, there's a scorpion on me. What? Why watch it and wait for it to sting you, man? So, we've got a poison there, so if we actually use what we made earlier, the anti-venom, we are golden. 
now you see that because it's pitch black. Well, there's a couple of these things in here now. God damn, man. Okay, what's this plant? Tobacco. Oh my god, mate. I'll tell you, boy. Come on. Let's go. Yeah. Give me feathers. Thanks. Right, we are quite low on health. We're in need of a camp, uh, some sleep, and some healing. Thorn bushes, nettles, mates, birds. Just everything's been attacking me on this treacherous path to find some water, which I don't really need because I'm doing fine on coconuts. Right, let's get some food down us. Kind of like to do some healing. Wow, that really got nice now. Look, there's something over there as well. So let's go investigate that. See this little bastard, look. Oh, we nailed at the spear. That was actually sick. Take that back. <laughs> okay. More Aztec -y ancient stuff. Oh, wow. Got oh, the sun dropping behind there. Oh, uh, no. It's just going to be over that rock, I, th I think. Now there's a snake here. Wrecked, mate. I'll tell you what, we've got two of these now. I'm going to use one. That sorted my health out. Jeez, man. Right, we've got some more living water. Wow, this looks sick. Right, there's actually, it looks like there's a fire down there, doesn't it? An orange glow. Do you think that's a survivor? Oh, fireflies. And he did say the location was near fireflies. Right, there's a door. We got some more stuff. We got a rope. A wall carving. Ah, we're fixing the wall carving. Okay, cool. Oh, an obsidian shard. I tell you what, if I can make an obsidian knife or something. Ha! Ah. And the great four returned young and fresh, as if it just a few days passed since they sailed off, rather than decades. And they brought happy news to the tribes. A large island was uh, Bimini, hidden beyond the fog of the belts. Its reefs and currents, the island was teeming with fruits, with animals and plants that were rare on the island. Um, but the treasure of uh, Bimini was the miraculous fountain found by the great four in the heart of the island. The fountain's water cured any disease and healed any wound, but even that was not its greatest miracle. Those who drank from the fountain stopped again, uh, aging for many years, staying young as if time held no power over them. They just left it on the floor. That is how so hard to see, man. Let's see why they did fireflies. Right, new goal. View from the mountain. Uh, right, oh, let's have a look at the goals. Climb to the white sign. Looks like I found the mountain pass. I will try to reach the top of the mountain near the white sign. Mapping range, 25%. So we don't actually pick it up. Yeah, there's some up there. I wish I could actually use the spyglass because it looks like there's something up there. Ouch. Thornbush things. Nice. Um, a stone head. Alright. Let's level up strength again. Mapping's leveled up. Gathering. We've got a PP point. I'm going to risk um, resist disease due to weather factors up by 30%. Nice. 
I know, mate. You need a snooze, but I also need some wide leaves to make a backpack. So you're going to have to hold on for a wee moment. We're on the verge of absolutely collapsing here. And we've got enough leaves for a bed. This looks like a, a path up, I tell you. These things. Out to get you. Oh, I'd well then. Holy crap, man. I didn't quite see that as a snake. It actually scared the life out of me. There's all the way up to a bridge. Progress is being made. Look at this. Right, uh, we've. I don't know if this is the tippy top. It's not the very top, but. There's something here. A cave. I'm hoping for a bed in it. We just crawled up this mountain absolutely exhausted. I hope it's not a bear or something here. Okay. Someone's been drawing the stars. There's something flashy at the end there. You got, mate, an improved torch. I was just saying, a dead Spaniard map. A map with blurred inscriptions in Spanish. A site of some kind of camp is marked here. Looks like the Spaniards are here long before us. Well, that's good news, though, because actually... Ah, oh, it works. We can see. What is this? Puffball mushroom. I think we can eat them on the fly. Two food and 13% chance of getting poorly. I think we should be going through the other way, because that's where the shiny thing was. Okay. What is this? A broken slab. One perk obtained. Let's, um... I don't know what to do with that. What level of athletics? Mapping. Uh, was this poison? Is it what I am going for? Which is, uh, yes. Very good. What is that? A bird potion. Ouch. Strength of the birds. A leaf or a bed? Yeah, it's something to explore. Ancient Observatory. Alright, that explains the paintings of the stars in the caves. Look. They've got reference points there. Ancient Observatory. Looks like astrologer watched the sky from different locations. Well, I reckon a bit of mapping from there would be good. Blueprints. What's this? Feather and ink. Excellent consumer or mapping tool. Okay, here we go. Now it's daytime. We can use the spyglass. Look at this. Over there, smoke signal, look. Okay. Right, build a sea vessel and build a dock. How sick is that? Right, we have to build a dock and a sea vessel. Look at this raft, man. I would definitely rather build this. Oh, yeah, boys and girls. So in the next episode, we are going to actually, um, we're going to build a bed first, get all our energy back. And then we're going to go down there, build a dock and a boat. That is <sighs> sick. We was actually just down there and was over there, actually. We've got the spyglass from that. Man. All right, guys. Thank you very much for watching another episode. Stay tuned for more. This is sick. And I'll catch you next one. Peace. I think the girls with their nails done. I'm gonna go